Well, it's a new year, a lot happening. We're not going to chat too much because Abe Ambrose is here with the Civic Center and he's got a lot of things to tell us about. So thanks for coming. <laughs> you bet. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Already starting on the 29th of this month or ending up the month of a neat show. Yeah. Just coming up this weekend on Sunday, uh, Dragons and Mythical Beast. It's a really fun show. Um, like you and I were chatting. If, if you've seen Lion King and kind of how they handle the, the, the animals on stage with the mm -hmm. puppetry, it's these great big animals, you know, th this giant looking dragon. It's a really cool show. Uh, kids are going to love it and, and, the, and the, the parents are going to like it too. You know, I'm a I'm a fan of uh, Dark Crystal and stuff like that, and some of that puppetry mm -hmm. that you've seen in movies is on stage now. It's really it's really That's impressive. Cool. All right, so get your tickets now for that. Get your All tickets right. now, absolutely. Okay, so you've got some comedians coming in, right? Is that what Mitchell T Tenpenny is? M no, Mitchell Tenpenny is a, a country artist. Oh, sorry. Oops. That's <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Um, Lima knows who he is. Okay, uh, good. <laughs> so tickets are really moving. We've only got a couple hundred left. So oh if, if you are a fan, uh, get your tickets now. LimaCivicCenter.com for all of your tickets. Uh, thank you to Honeywell Arts for bringing Mitchell Tenpenny here. We obviously love our country music here. Yes, That's what yes, obvious. very all popular. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the never-ending story. Tell us about that on the 19th. So that's one of our movies. So we brought this back this year. It took a couple years off, uh, but we brought our movie series back, and we've already done a few, and, and uh, never-ending story is the next one. And it's it's a great opportunity to bring kids into a theater on, and see a movie on a 60-foot screen. You know, you and I remember that, watching movies on 60-foot screens. It's just, it, it blows you away. That's theater, uh -huh. and that's what we get to do with some of these old shows that were originally on 60-foot screens like this one. So you see Falcor flying through the sky on a 60-foot screen screen it's it's awesome it's better than streaming at home that's, that's for right. sure all right so people love golf around here and we've got indoor golf the foundation doing a fundraiser so hurry up if you wanted to participate yeah so this is our third year doing it we just kind of you know thought maybe this was a good idea and we'd try it and it's really popular and it filled up every year so this year we added a day and we've only got about three spots left so if you are interested uh, t contact Carmen Cicala Wells. Her information is at LimaCivicCenter.com and uh, get your team booked up now. Or if you want to be a sponsor, uh, we're looking yeah. at those as well. So, yeah, it's a great event. All right, so the Broadway series returns on March 13th, and it's My Fair Lady. What a classic. An absolute classic, yeah. Uh, you know, we love our Broadway. You know, we... we Lima loves country. Lima also loves Broadway. Mm -hmm. You know, we've and we've had a great Broadway series the last couple of years. And My Fair Lady is the end of that subscription for us this year. Uh, but yeah, it's just a classic Broadway show. Huge scenes, huge songs and I was numbers. Say the, the songs for yeah, sure. Yeah, just big classic songs that you all know. And, and the costumes are just incredible. It's mm -hmm. it's a great show. And just a reminder, you know, if you're going to Columbus, Cincinnati, Cleveland, et cetera, for Broadway, good for you. You should. It's great theater. But a lot of those same shows that we have here are the same ones that go to Columbus, Cincinnati, and Cleveland. So right. it's the same cast, same show. And if you're not a subscription subscriber to it right now, there's tickets available, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Yeah. Still yeah. tickets so available for all it. of our shows. All right. And Simon and Garfunkel fans, they're going to love this show coming yeah, up. Right? That's this another, is a different show. Yeah, that's another cool one. You know, that's an add-on. So if you are a subscriber, you can get a discounted ticket for Simon and Garfunkel, but if not, you can still get a great seat for that one. It's not Simon and Garfunkel. Right. We all wish that they still got along and would still perform, but <laughs> they, they don't. Uh, but this is a great opportunity to see a, a show that's a lot like them. Um, kind of think Jersey Boys, but a lighter method of, okay. of that, because it's not all the stage pieces and it's not all the story, uh, but it's great music. It's all of their music, and they do tell some of the stories that are behind the songs, what was motivating them, what oh. was going on in the world, and, and they talk about some of those things. That's fun to learn. Yeah. All right. Speaking of great music, Amy Grant is coming on uh, March 24th. <laughs> yes. Finally, we've got Amy here. So we've been working on the, you know, on this show for a while. Um, we had some 2020 delays that happened, and then just other things happened. She's had some health scares, but it's going to happen. <laughs> we've got Amy Grant coming. We're really excited about uh, having Amy Grant in Lima, Ohio. Tickets are are moving um, fast now, you know, because we're getting closer to the show. Um, and that's a show that we really expect to sell out based on her ticket sale average. So we should she just won the Kennedy Center honor for heaven's sakes, people? Exactly. Come Don't on. Wait. Don't All wait right, on here's a comedian. I know this guy's comedian, <laughs> right? We've got a comedy coming, Joey, right? Yeah, Joe Gatto. <laughs> that's a. Uh, it's you know, so Lima loves country. Lima loves Broadway. They also love comedy because we had to add a second show for Joe Gatto. So See, seven o'clock cool. and nine thirty on um, what is that? April twentieth. April twentieth. Okay, very yeah. good. Get your tickets now for all of this. Go to the Civic Center website. Abe, thanks for coming. Thank you. All right, don't go away. We'll look at the weather forecast next.